All right, what's going on, everybody? My name is Shadowgul131, and we are back. We're finally back today with a brand new Let's Play for you guys. It has been a long time, but we've got ourselves a Pokemon Y Wonderlock, and I have to tell you guys, I'm super excited. Let's see what Professor Sycamore has to say, and then we will pick up back with my excitement. I'm Augustine Sycamore, the Kalos region's very own Pokemon professor. This world of ours is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. These mysterious creatures can be found in every corner of our world. Some run across the plains, others fly through the skies, and others yet swim deep in the ocean. We live together with these Pokemon, lending our strength to one another to live and prosper. Let's get started with some quick questions. Are you a boy or are you a girl? We are, of course, a boy. And we look like that. Oh, ho, oh, I see. Would you tell me your name? Of course we will, Professor Sycamore. Our name is Shadow. Whoops. Okay, come on. Shadow. Perfect. So it's Shadow then, did I get that right? Sure did. Shadow, Trasbien, what a fantastic name. Trabian, probably. <laughs> Shadow, your adventure begins now. Something in Kalos. Go and meet many people and Pokemon and experiences and let's go visit the world of Pokemon. You guys, I have not played this game in so long. I am so excited. It's been forever, but I'm super, super excited. I've never done a Wonderlock before, you guys. So, if you guys are not familiar with the idea of a Wonderlock, let me go ahead and fill you guys in real quick. It's obviously a Nuzlocke. Um, so, for those of you who don't know the Nuzlocke rules, you have to catch the first Pokemon on each route. If a Pokemon faints, it's considered dead and must be boxed or released. And then you have to nickname all of your Pokemon. A wonder lock adds in the wonder trade aspect to that. So, do we have a computer in here? Is there a potion? Oh no, that's just rules. Okay. So, I think we can change our appearance here, maybe? It's been a long time since I've played this game. Oh, we just get ready. Okay. We change out of our pajamas. Alright, so, anyways, a Wonderlock, um, you take the first Pokemon from each route, and then you Wonder Trade it, and you use the Pokemon you get in return. So, obviously, the nicknames kind of don't matter, they don't come into play as much. Um, maybe we'll see if it's if it's a huge ordeal to re-nickname Pokemon that we get, I'm not sure, but we can look into that. Morning, Shadow. You sure slept well, all rested up from the move? It's about time you got going. Why don't you step out and say hello to the neighbors? Okay, Mom. Whatever you say. So anyways, so that's pretty much it. And then I think I'm going to institute like the dupes clause and the two high level clause, I think. Because I don't want to have to deal with the Pokemon not listening to me if I, get, if I trade off my level 5 starter and get a level 80 or something like that. Welcome to Vanneville Town. Oh, sorry, this is Serena. My name's Serena, and I'm your neighbor. And I'm Shauna, great to meet you. Guess what, we've come to get you. The esteemed Professor Sycamore lives here in the Kalos region. I was told he has a request for five kids, including us, but I'm a little surprised he knows who you are. You did just move to Vanneville Town, after all. We'll wait for you in the next town over, and you know what? We're going to get a Pokemon! Come on, hurry, let's go! Alright, you guys, you if you've watched my Let's Plays, you know I'm terrible with the voices, especially the girl voices. So I don't know how long we're going to keep that up. But let's see what's going on here. Oh my gosh, I forgot how much I enjoyed this game, you guys. It's been forever since I've played this game. And it's just so awesome. So that's Serena's mom. Nothing special there. I think we might as well just go ahead and go check out the professor and meet the rest of our friends and all of that good stuff. 
What's this place? I actually don't even remember. Oh, it's just... Just more house. Another house. Would you look at that? You got a pair of running shoes, my friend. Oh, I forgot. I forgot we got the running shoes right off the bat. That's really cool. Alright, so let's keep going. Let's make our way down. Um, I apologize. I have the fan going in the background. If you guys can hear that, I do apologize for that. Um, and I'm hoping there's no audio issues here as well with the game audio. This is my first time. Obviously, if you guys don't know... Hey, Shadow, this way, over here. If you don't know, this is my first time... My first series with the, my new capture card. I've got I've had the capture card for a couple months now. Um, I've streamed with it, um, qu not quite often, but a few times. This is my first um, let's play with it, so I'm super excited for that. But it's the first time I've hooked up the audio, so hopefully there's no issues there. Um, I've got I've done my best to try and hook it up as best as possible. So hopefully hopefully it goes smoothly. This is the meeting place, Shadow. Here, let me introduce you, everyone. This is Shadow. Wow, Shauna's description was spot on. So, Shadow, this is Tierno. He's got some serious dance moves. And this is Trevor. He never misses a single question on his tests, but he's a little shy. All right, nice to meet you. You know, it'd feel like we're a closer crew if we call each other by nicknames. Can I call you S-Meister? What? No way. He's a little S for sure. What do you think, Trevor? What? You want me to nickname someone I just met? Shauna, you shouldn't put people on the spot like this. How about something low-key? Maybe something like Big S. Why don't you decide what we should call you? I like Lil S. We're gonna go with Lil S. You want us to call you Lil S? Oh, I'm getting hers and Trevor's. Oh my gosh, okay. Can we see the Pokemon now? Blah, blah, blah. Let's get this Pokemon. I'm not gonna read all of the dialogue because I'm sure most of you guys, I mean, X and Y have been out forever, so I'm sure you guys are familiar with the dialogue. And it doesn't matter who we choose because it is gonna get Wonder Traded away. So, I'm going to choose Fennekin. We'll choose Fennekin. Awesome. I, I think the first time when I played through X, I picked Froki, I'm pretty sure. We're going to nickname this SG Wonder Trade. Or Wonder Lock, if that will fit. That'll work. We're gonna I'm gonna try and remember to nickname all of them that. So that way if anyone else gets it, um, they'll have some idea. And I mean if anyone watches these videos and they get a Pokemon named that, uh, they'll know who it is. But I'm not gonna like tweet out when I'm wonder trading or whatever, but if you just happen to get lucky and get the get the Pokemon I Wonder Trade out. I mean, that's gonna be cool. So we get our Pokedex, and he wants us to fill it all up. I forgot about this game. Like, we don't even get anything from the Professor. We just get it from our friends. I I totally forgot about that. All right. So they're gonna go look for Pokemon. We gotta go back and give that letter to Mom and let her know that we are gonna head out on a journey so that she understands. So let's run back and go give this letter to mom. Lil S, wait! You're gonna be my opponent in my Pokemon battling debut. Okay, Lil Chespin, it's our first battle. Let's win it with style. All right, Shauna. Obviously, guys, the Nuzlocke does not start until we get Pokeballs. That's the same rules apply, so we will do our wonder trading. I'm not even sure if we have access to wonder trade yet. I'm not sure how that works in this game. But once we once we get our pokeballs and we I'm going to wait to wonder trade this thing until we we have our next one to wonder trade as well. And hopefully that will be in this episode. I think that's where I want to end this episode is with our first wonder trades. So hopefully we can move right along here and I'm not sure at what point we get pokeballs. But hopefully it is soon. Alright, so we might get a level out of that. I don't... I'm, I'm trying to decide if I want to mess around with, like, level rules while I'm wonder trading. Like, so... 
we level trade or wonder trade off a level six do I don't necessarily it's okay if I get a level one or level two I think I don't I don't know that's tough because if I if I get a level one and then I have to train it up you know that's gonna be hard I don't know we'll have to see what kind of stuff we get in wonder trade before I make a decision so here's mom we're gonna give her the letter is that a Pokeball? You got your very own Pokemon? How about that? You're a Pokemon trainer now, too. Congratulations. A letter from Sycamore. Could it be a love letter? Mom. Come on, now. But lovely handwriting. Shadow, we've barely unpacked and all kinds of exciting things are happening. Let's get you and Fennekin ready for your journey. Where are you going, Mom? Here you are. I've even packed a change of clothes. You, met, you made friends, you met your Pokemon, now you get to take a lap around Kalos. And don't forget the town map. How could we? You know how to use a town map, right? Of course we do. She still tells us anyways. Alright, so we are good to go. I'm not gonna... Oh, here's Raihorn. This was a really cool feature too, and I like how they're kind of bringing it back into Sun and Moon with the rental Pokemon that you can use or whatever. And there was a lot of speculation about that, like if it's going to get rid of HMs or anything like that. I think that's going to be, if it does, I hope that's what their purpose is, because that would be really cool. Um, and so that brings me to kind of why I, why I chose to do, or my first Let's Play with the capture card to be Y. One, because I've played X before. I've never played Y. Two, because Sun and Moon are coming out soon, so there's a there's like a small chance, I feel like, that we could end up back in Kalos at some point. So I just wanted to come back. I think this might be a Poke Shop. Pokemart. I don't know if we can get Pokeballs. It does. We can. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and get... 10 Pokeballs and a Premier Ball. Awesome. Okay, so let's see if we can get any more potions too. In that case, we're going to go ahead and catch a Pokemon. This looks like a potion shop. Oh my gosh, I didn't realize it was that quick. This is crazy. We sell only the best potions. So we can get five, and I'm going to spend all of my money and get five. Okay, so the Nuzlocke is officially underway here here in episode one. Um, that makes me really nervous, you guys. We've had pretty bad luck before with Nuzlocke's, but I'm confident that this one, I mean, the game is known to be easier than the other games anyway. All right, so we're going to get an encounter in here. It, it does not matter what it is, you guys. Um, I'm probably going to repeat that over and over again because they're all going to get wonder traded away. But I like this game too more than X and, or more than Oros because you see you, there's so much more of a variety of Pokemon available right off the bat. So let's scratch. We don't want to kill this thing. All right, so that looks like it did about a third. So I'm going to do one more. Okay, perfect. Let's catch this thing. And then we will wonder trade these two guys off and see what we get. I'm wondering if I should hang on to Fennekin here until I get a Pokemon that I can use to level up whatever I get for him. You guys get what I'm saying? So, like, say I trade off this Pidgey, and we get a level 1 Machop. Um, in that case, I would use Fennekin to switch train up Machop until he's level 5 or 6 or whatever. Um, I think Pidgey's level 4. Was he? It doesn't say here. Alright, so we're gonna go S, G, Wonderlock. Um, but do you, does that make sense to you guys? I think I might do that. We'll see what we end up getting for Pidgey. If it's something that we can use right away, then I'm just not going to worry about it. But let's go ahead and connect to the internet here. Hopefully this, this should not take too long. But I'm just trying to make sure, like, I don't want to 
train a level 1 up against level 4 or 5 Pidgeys because we don't have a good shot there at beating those. So, I'm, I just don't know what to do. We'll trade Pidgey off first. I guess we could trade Fennekin off first. So let's wonder trade. How many times do we have to save? Oh my gosh. Do you want to start a wonder trade? Yes, we do. And we want to wonder trade. So level 3 Pidgey. So let's trade this Pidgey and see what we get. Hopefully something good. Hola, ¿qué tal? Hernan from Chile. Very nice. Hook us up, Hernan. Hook us up. I'm excited, you guys. Oh, we get a Zigzagoon. Of course we get a Zigzagoon. You know what? That's alright. It could have been worse. It really could have been worse. I just hope it's not level 1. If it's level 5, level 3, that's going to be viable. Take good care of Zigzagoon. Okay. We'll try, I guess. We'll try, I guess. Let's take a look at this Zigzagoon before we... It's level 2. So, it has pickup, which is really nice. Really useful. Tackle and growl. From a faraway place. Met at level 2. Where do I see the na caref careful nature? Which isn't bad at all, actually. Maybe for a Zigzagoon it is. But what? Okay, so what I'm going to do is we're going to just switch train this thing up a little bit. And once we get to level 5 or so, we'll go ahead and we will wonder trade off our Fennekin. So there's a Fletchling... And, you know, we might be able to handle these battles by ourselves, too. We might not need Fennekin. So it does have Growl, which is going to lower our attack. Let's see how much we do. Not very much. So I am going to switch here. We are going to go out into Fennekin. We want to be careful, though, because I don't want to lose Fennekin, either. So we have to be careful. So that did four. Oh gosh, I don't want to use a potion already, but I'm too nervous not to. So if this thing gets a crit, we're going down, and that's a po that that loses us a Pokemon. Did not get a crit, but I don't care. It's not worth the risk to me. Let's go ahead and Ember, because we're just we're just looking to kill. We don't need to catch this thing this time. Ember's fine with me. level. Hopefully, uh, Zigzagoon gains a level. Oh yeah, because it is boosted experience. So that's going to help us out as well. So we'll just level him up maybe one or two more levels here. Get him to level five. I'll feel comfortable with that. Alright, so there's a level three. We're a level three. We're just going to tackle this thing see who's stronger. Looks like we're about the same. I might be a touch stronger. I'm faster at least. That did a lot. So he's going to lower our attack there, which is fine. Whoa. I think one more should knock this thing out. How did it outspeed? Oh my god! Holy, holy, <laughs> oh my god, it is too early. You guys, it is episode one. We're living on one HP. Are you serious? <laughs> it's going to It's going to be a very long Let's Play, isn't it? I can already tell it's going to be a very long Let's Play. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. Okay, let's heal that thing up. 
<laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, Zigzagoon, you're level four. So one more one more Pokemon here might do it. Okay. I'm not thrilled about having a Zigzagoon. But I think we can make it work. I think it'll be okay. I did forget about the boost experience, so I don't want to get it too strong. Because after level 10, he's going to stop listening. Alright, so one more tackle here, and we will wipe this thing out. Got a crit there, and it did... Six, five, did five. So nothing to worry about with a little scatter bug. Twenty-nine. So one more battle here should do it. Just want to get to nice and level five, and then the next guy we will just um, level up as we play the game. And I actually might wrap that episode up or this episode up after we get rid of our Fennekin. Uh, I want to keep these episodes around 20-ish minutes, 20-25 minutes. Um, okay, that did a lot. Why does that, why are we so weak to this? Alright, let's go out to Fennekin. He goes for the Growl, but that's okay. I don't know if Ember hits physically or specially, actually. I want to say special because it's fire but it seems like it's probably physical. All right, so he gained 16, there we go. Zigzagoon is level five. Learns Tail Whip, which is useful. For now. For now, it's useful. All right, so let's Wonder Trade off our Fennekin. I'm nervous, you guys. I don't want two Zigzagoons. We do ha we do have Dupes Claws in effect, so if we do get another Zigzagoon, we can trade it back. Um, so hopefully we get something. Something I don't want like a legendary necessarily. I mean that would be kind of cool, um, but maybe from like the third or fourth encounter, you know, not the not our starter. But we'll see what we end up getting. We will see if we can find a trade partner that is. So let's try this again. Alright, so we get Zachriel from California. Nice to meet you, Zachriel. That's kind of a sweet name. Hopefully you're hooking us up here. Hopefully, hopefully. Bye, Fennekin. Oh, cool. Alright. I'll take an Esper. I'll take an Esper for sure. Very nice. I'm happy with that. I am happy with that. So Esper is our starter, you guys, and Zigzagoon is our first encounter. So let's let's do a little team recap here to end off the episode. We've got a level one Esper, so I am glad that we leveled up Zigzagoon. She knows Scratch and Leer. She is modest nature from a daycare couple, so she might have decent IVs. He might have been breeding for a shiny or something. But Modest Nature is not bad at all. She's got Keen Eye, so she can't get her accuracy lowered. 
Zigzagoon, we've already looked at. Pick up, careful nature, tackle, growl, and tail whip. Very nice, very nice. I'm excited. These guys are going to level up fast. I forgot about that. I did not take that into account. Uh, let's see what item he has, too. We got a potion. Very cool. So we are going to use that right on Zigzagoon right now, and then we're going to wrap this up. But if you guys are excited for this series, please hit that like button for me. Share this video with your friends. Post on Facebook, wherever you have social media or whatever. I'm excited. I'm so, so excited to be back in the Let's Play game. Um, and I think I might do, I don't know, I've played it so much, but I might do like Omega Ruby after this. Um, if I get this done and I have time before Sun and Moon because I am going to be playing through that when that comes out. But if you guys are hyped, let me know down in the comments below. Um, let me know if you guys want me to tweet out when I'm trading and all that kind of stuff. Follow me on Twitter, of course, if you don't. But I think that's going to do it for episode one. Like I said, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss the next episodes. And hit the like button for me so I know you're enjoying it. You're glad to see me back in the Let's Play game. But I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you in the next video.